What's good, you two? Immortal Soul 111. It's your boy Keith, and I'm back with another one. Y'all you know, see my ways looking like a motherfucking honeycomb. Yes, sir. But, anyways, man, nothing but love and positive energy. I'm sending to y'all in this video. But I want to talk about why you should never feel guilty for doing what is best for you. Yes, bro. A lot of the times we hold our own self back because we always say, we always feel guilty for saying no. When somebody asks us to do something, bro, you no, know, damn well we should have said no. Like we ain't really had no business doing it or stepping out the house, you know. Well, we supposed to be getting our work done or we we supposed to be uploading the video, you know. No, damn well we ain't got that shit taken care of. But we be so quick to hop out, you know, pop out and shit, go to the club, go turn with friends, you know, go to the mall, you know, anything that's taking us away from our purpose, right? So if you can't help your own soul, bro, if you're not there for your own soul, then you have no business and you should never feel guilty for doing what is best for you. A lot of situations, a lot of stuff you can avoid is by saying no. Get used to saying no. You know, I've learned throughout my life, man, throughout my spiritual journey, but you have to say no, bro. Because at heart, bro, we are pure beings, bro. My nigga, you know, if you're watching this video, you know, you you know who I am and you know what I do. And, you know, I'm quite sure that you on the same shit. All our life, my nigga, we've been trained. We have been distilled with these false ideologies and illusions to say yes. Be a people pleaser. Be nice. No, sometimes you just always, you just can't be nice, bro. You know, it's all about a balance. Too much of something is bad for you. Yes, we know this. So do what's best for you. You know, whatever your heart is telling you, go with it. You know, don't listen to your mind. Don't listen to your your feelings and shit. Listen to your heart, bro. If that makes any sense. So that's how you do it. That's how you do what is best for you. The day you will realize that it was the best thing to go with. It was the best thing to do from the jump. A lot of distractions. Distractions can be friends, family, your parents, your intermediate family. It could be anybody. You have to be aware of who is distracting you and who is making you better and who is contributing to what you got going on. And if they are not contributing, y'all seen that shit? If you, if, and if they are not helping you out, if y'all not, fuck that, if y'all not helping each other out, y'all shouldn't even be hanging around each other. I have no purpose and have no business of, of being around each other. And that's simple, bro. Protect y'all energy, protect y'all peace. Is you versus you at the end of the day. Love yourself, man. Practice self-love. You know, day to day, bro. Reflect on your emotions. Reflect on your actions. You know, this is what makes you a better person, a better spiritual being. Reflect. Journal. You know, make a gratitude journal. Practice gratitude. You know, practice good habits instead of the bad ones. Write down all of your negative habits and replace them with good ones. And that's what you do what is best for you. <laughs> your goals, stay consistent, stay disciplined. Consistency, you need consistency. You need it, you need that shit repetitive, my nigga. Over and over. You cannot stop, you cannot give up on nothing. You got to keep going no matter what. Yes, you may rest, but never give up. Never stop going. <laughs> Y'all see this? Uh, yes, sir. I feel like, geyser, geyser. You feel me? I don't know why niggas be doing that shit. I be, I've been noticing a lot of motherfuckers around me doing that shit. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. That shit do feel like you get like a, a extra boost. Just got a five plus boost on my... Taking care of you will be the best decision and the best thing that you ever work on throughout life. You know, you are your self art, my nigga. You are the portrait, my nigga. So, 20 years from now, you don't want to be stagnant. You don't want to be in the same place as you are today. You want to grow. You know, you want to move on throughout life. You want to experience. You want to gain knowledge and wisdom, right? So, you have to skip out on the fun so you can get to the funds. Skip the fun so you can get to the funds. You feel me? You know, work on yourself, man. I'm telling y'all every day, every day. You know, some. I'm not saying you can't have no fun. I'm not saying you can't do shit that you want to do. But just make sure you take care of your business first, man. Get your priorities straight. Make sure you straight before you take care of anybody else. 
it's not selfish. People who tell you that you're selfish for doing that or thinking like that, bro, they're delusional. Don't listen to them, my nigga. Them the same motherfuckers that, that they will not help you. If you was to be down and at your lowest, they will not help you. Okay? Remember that. I know. I've been there. And if you've been there, bro, let me know down in the comment section. But yeah, man, I'm finna go and wrap this video up. Um, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share the video. You are new, man. Immortal Soul 111. It's your boy Keith, and I'm on the road. And I'm out. <laughs>